Good morning, fellow mathematicians. Welcome back to another video. In normal case, I have planned something completely different for Wednesday, so to today. So like a math video, that's what I usually do on this channel, you know. But um, I thought I might as well um, keep you updated on some community posts and what I have done this semester, etc. Et Take a look at the top of the description. I will be linked to the last basic update video on this channel. Um, yeah, and, and you might have seen it in the title, blah, blah, blah. Um, then my situation is is kind of fucked at the moment. I'm I'm feeling kind of restless and, and stressed out a bit. Not not depressed or anything, but uh, I don't know what to do at the moment. It's it's kind of um, pretty much um, I'm in a pinch at the moment. <laughs> you could say, um, uh, Mr. Stark. I'm not feeling too well. And after this update, uh, I can also give you some more updates about what this room is all about and etc. PP. Let us go ahead. Some of you might not know about my background. Uh, I'm going to elaborate on this a bit more. No, I'm not doing a master's. I'm a grad student at the moment of science, neither in maths nor in physics. I'm doing kind of a triple degree at the moment in pedagogical studies, mathematics and physics because I'm striving to become a teacher. I'm going for my master's of education at the moment. This is what I'm doing. I'm not doing any kind of research or whatsoever. At the moment, I'm in my last semester and starting in April, I planned on doing my referendariat. That's like the preparation service you have to do before you can become a full-fledged teacher. In Brandenburg, where I originally started, it would have been 12 months. But here in Saxony-Anhalt, where I just moved with my wife, it would be 16 months. Okay, keep this in mind. Saxony-Anhalt is going to be important in a minute. Now. What is my problem at the moment? So this semester I had a lot of shit to do. It was extremely stressing for me. I'm, I was kind of feeling stressed out this semester. So what I had to do is I was working 19 hours per week in my university, um, being like the tutorial boy for the info boys and, and whatsoever. Then I was working in a school in my praxis semester. It's a practical part about 12 hours per week. Also, I was doing YouTube basically full time. You, you could say um, it's, it's kind of my job right now at, at this point. Um, what other things did I do? I had other jobs like uh, giving tutorials to um, 13 year olds whatsoever in my free time. And yeah, many other things. I'm also writing my master's thesis at the moment. That's going to become important later in a minute and I was having other courses. So, so this, this semester in and of itself was um, just fucking ridiculous up until this point. So um, where should I start? Yeah, um, I'm writing my master's degree at the moment and I planned on um, reaching in my master's thesis to my, to my professor like end of March. This was the plan at first and then I would get my master's degree, my master's of education like four weeks later and then I could go ahead and start with the referendariat, this preparation service before you can become a full-fledged teacher. Now here's the point. Um, in, in Brandenburg, in normal case, you would go through like this, okay, master's thesis, getting your master's degree and then you would start needlessly into this referendariat. Now here's the thing, I was moving to Saxony-Anhalt and now at the end of January, I was applying to the Landesschulamt, that's the institution that basically uh, manages all of the applications and they um, try to get you to a school that you like or whatsoever to become a teacher. And then this person was calling me and she said, well, um, up until the 15th of February, this is going to be in like three days, you have to give me your master's, fee, uh, your, your master's de degree um, such that we can actually get you into this referendariat. Now here's the thing. This is not fucking possible. This is not possible, not even in the least bit, okay? For people studying in Brandenburg, it's not fucking possible. And this is annoying the, this is annoying the fuck out of me. And now I was having a deal with this person. Up until the 13th of March, I could still reach in my master's degree and I could still become part of this referendariat. Okay? This is still not fucking possible for me because 
like the 26th of March is the last day where I could actually reach in my master's thesis and basically I need this time to finish everything up because it's a fucking master thesis and it takes ages in normal case. Yes, um, now I was freaking out a little bit because um, if I couldn't apply for this referendariat for April I would have to wait like half a year and that would be just a fucking waste of time. Now I went to my professor, Dr. Brauns, whatsoever, PhD boy, <laughs> and talked to him about my master's thesis. Would it be possible to um, give you my master's thesis like end of February, like in, in two weeks from, from now on, okay? I still had a, a lot of other shit to do, a lot of um, um, not really exams, but um, essays I still have to give to my u university people. So like there were like, five or six essays I still had to put out there to my university and yeah he, he said yes okay um, I could actually look over the master's thesis and give you your grade like in in like one week or so this is what Dr. Braun said and I think that is really cool from him um, I'm at the moment striving for the worst grade possible on my master's thesis so there's just going to be like the scaffold of this whole master's thesis and this is basically going to allow me to pass this whole thing but with the worst grade possible and this is just for the purpose to actually get into the referendariat. But, but now here is the other thing, I had to talk to all the other people in the institution that actually had to sign everything such that I can get my master's degree. The, the master's degree is the really important thing of this whole um, getting into this preparation service. Well. Then I went to the, um, to the board of examiners and I also went to the dean and they both only have like one week of time in March to actually sign everything and, and this is like a really really short frame of time and, and in normal case University of Potsdam needs like one or two months to actually get all the master's degrees out to the people and it's like a fucking mess at the moment. I really don't know what to do. I haven't really started off with my master's thesis right now, so, so I don't even have three weeks left to write those 50 pages of the master's thesis on the, um, what's my, uh, what am I writing about, the diffractional derivatives of the Riemann zeta function and the Dirichlet eta function. And uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's just a real fucking mess. I hope you can see where I'm um, at at the moment. Um, I don't know if this video is kind of fucking confusing for you I don't know but yeah um, this is where I'm at at the moment and and it's like really stressing doing YouTube and I ah, know YouTube isn't even the really stressing thing it's it's more like this bureaucracy here in German it's I don't know what to do it's I'm kind of in a pinch at the moment I don't know if I can finish everything up up until the end of February and and it's kind of nerve-wracking I would like to start off with this preparation service but I really don't know if I can. It's, I don't know what to do at the moment. So um, if you have any capacities and maybe want to help me out with my master's thesis, even if it's just looking over um, how it's written, like in the last stages of the master's thesis, maybe being put together, then, then I would highly appreciate it. Other than that, uh, yeah, this has been uh, the main point of the video. What other things are there? Um, like I said, I have moved out with my girlfriend from Potsdam. Now we are here in Saxony-Anhalt and at the moment I'm placing all of those sound absorbers here at the wall. So uh, this has been the setup from the last live stream. <laughs> it's uh, looking way better than before. Uh, what a bad time to be alive. But I still thank you guys for your great support. Um, you are a real help to me. So um, you are keeping me cheered up all the time. And you are such a financial support to, to me overall. So um, because of you, I can afford all of this stuff there at the wall. Even this like <laughs> kitty wallpaper here. Isn't that um, fucking amazing? This is actually from the person that lived here before with their child. No, my, my wife is not expecting. Yeah, um, this has been the update video, uh, kind of a messy update video. I'm, I'm terribly sorry, but I hope you still did enjoy this video. Um, if you want to show some support, send me some emails. Maybe you have some suggestions how I can 
uh, kind of finish everything up in time. And yeah, I hope this video wasn't too confusing <laughs> for you guys. I just wanted to talk about my situation that I'm in at the moment. Um, yeah, if you did enjoy this video, blah, 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 please like and subscribe um, to the channel if you like sound absorbers. Yeah, um, and up until the next video, have a sound absorber day. Ciao. <laughs>